knowing about something about leadership, for example, and actually doing leadership are two totally different things. Wow, I feel like I should be taking this program. Oh. <laughs> I should have been taking this program a while ago. So that I think leadership is not a choice. It is something which is mandated upon us. Sabri, how are you today? Good morning, Rodan. I'm good, thank you. How are you doing? I'm excellent. Would you mind telling us a little bit about yourself and what do you do at ASB? Well, I'm a Malaysian. I was born in Malaysia and I've been working in a few companies already by now, but the longest time spent was in oil, in oil and gas. And since uh, 10 years ago, I have been with ICLIF conducting programs for the company. So I understand you're teaching a very exciting executive program. It's called emerging leaders and you are the lead faculty for this program. Can you tell us a little bit about it? Uh, conducted over three and a half days, um, the Emerging Leaders is a program, it's an open enrollment program, meaning to say we have people from various organizations, various industries coming together to form the learning community. And the last time we ran the program was in Cambodia and we had, I remember correctly, nothing less than five nationalities uh, coming together to, to form the learning community of the program. Why is this program important to you? Why do you spend time trying to learn about emerging leadership? It's important to me because I've discovered the conclusion that knowing about something, about leadership for example, and actually doing leadership are two totally different things. So what emerging leaders does, it converts that thing that you know into actionable behaviours that your organisation and your people can benefit from. That's what it does very, very well. Wow, I feel like I should be taking this programme. Oh. <laughs> I should have been taking this programme a while ago, right? <laughs> So when you think about the specific business challenges that somebody uh, uh, is going through, be that an individual or organization, what challenges is this program addressing? It addresses the challenge of, of the, the lack of leadership skills amongst people. Sometimes uh, the most dam damaging thing that, could, that a company could do is to take a person who is severely lacking in leadership skills and give him a position of high level position in that company, the damage done is, is irreversible mm. sometimes in my, in my experience. That's why I think emerging leaders really, as the name suggests, allows the leader in you to emerge and, and, and put into practice all the right skills in place. And the so faculty must be really beautiful to see that happening in a classroom, right? It is very rewarding to see that happening in front of your eyes. Yes, it is. So let's think a little bit about the impact speaking of seeing what you see in the classroom. Right. Let's think a little bit about the impact that this program can have both on individuals, mm -hmm. on organizations. What do you think? The, the program can be renamed as the, not emerging leaders, but a program of discovering your leadership skills in you. Because we do not teach leadership uh, in the program. What we do is we guide people to discover what is it that's important to them, what few things are really meaningful to them, and by answering those couple of questions, you get to discover your leadership path and that's what leadership is all about. Program Sounds very transformative. Yes. It is a very transformative program at the end of the day. Yes, it Which is. Which is what we do at ASB, right? We're all about being transformative exactly. and principled, extraordinary exactly. and unconventional, smart and sharp. Exactly. <laughs> do you have any final words for people interested in becoming an emerging leader or discovering the emerging leader in herself, himself, by taking this ASB ICLIF program? Uh, as a Muslim, I hope you don't mind, uh, the Prophet says, even on a journey of three people, make one of you the leader. You know, And I think that uh, because of that, I think leadership is not a choice. It is something which is mandated upon us. If you're, if you're a living, working, breathing person, working with other living, breathing human beings in the, in the office, I think you have to learn something about leadership. And uh, by all means, come to see me at Emerging Leaders and we'll transform you into what we think you can be more than capable of being.